Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to introduce to you your anchors for tonight's division finals, Tyler McCrary and Stephanie Hadegi. We are getting to the end of the 2021 VEX Robotics World Championship. We are about to get started with overall division finals, and we are so excited. Tyler, do you have any predictions for the VIQC Middle School Division Finals? Well, so far, all the middle school teams are looking great out there. But I'm keeping my eye on Team 47C with Fire and 74801B copy-paste. These teams were so in sync during their LRT matches yesterday. I think we can just expect to see great things from them. Also, 10330A from Mexico. This team's robot was so fun to watch and was stacking risers with ease just all over the field. What do you think, Stephanie? Who's the top alliance here? Oh, I, I'm not super sure. You know, these things are always really difficult to call. And for me, I really saw three divisions stand out in uh, middle school VIQC. So, of course, math had a strong showing of uh, multiple contenders, and math B hit max score multiple times. But for me, I'm going to go with engineering B. They were my favorite, partially because I was on the field and partially because they have one of the coolest robots I have ever seen. <laughs> I, I, we have dubbed it the dorsal robot because it is so cool. It, um, so it's 126C Fnatic out of uh, Jalisco, Mexico. And I'm hoping they make it out of their division. They have like a claw that grabs from the back, grabs from the front, flips over to stack the risers on top of each other. And I think it is the coolest thing, the most innovative thing I've seen in this competition because it saves so much time. They don't have to turn around to grab a riser and then turn around again. They can just grab it and go. It allows them to make the most efficient like drive pathways that I have seen. So I'm going to go with them. <laughs> that's, that's who I'm going to pick. I don't know. I don't know if it'll pan out, but they have a cool robot. So before we get into the action, let's take a moment to appreciate one of the many people and sponsors who helped put this together. Our sponsor spotlight for today is NASA. Hi, I'm Drew Price, the project manager of NASA's Robotics Alliance project, otherwise known as RAP. Hey, VEX Worlds. I'm Candace Campanelli, the project coordinator of RAP. Congratulations for making it to the 2021 VEX Worlds. We're coming to you from the Clear Creek ISD Robotics Event Center. This place is amazing. In a few weeks, this venue will host the Space City Showcase Competition for VEX IQ and EDR teams. And we cannot wait to see the teams in action. You guys have done a great job persevering through a challenging year. We're proud of what you have accomplished and can't wait to see your impressive robots throughout this live remote tournament. We're really excited to be here with you for the 2021 VEX Worlds. NASA has been busy since the last time we're here with you. We've begun to send humans into space from American soil again, and we have sent astronauts to the International Space Station on SpaceX Crew Dragons. We launched the Mars 2020 mission in the summer with a Perseverance rover and Ingenuity helicopter landing earlier this year. Perseverance has begun to rope, and Ingenuity had its first flight a few weeks back. So inspiring. And we continue to work diligently to return humans to the surface of the moon and ultimately to Mars. We are always looking for talented individuals. If you'd like to join us, please consider becoming a NASA intern. You can find more information about NASA internships at intern.nasa.gov. RAP is proud to support VEX and the Robotics Education and Competition Foundation, and we're super happy to support you and your team. We were also delighted to work with the RECF to develop the first RECF Aerial Drone Competition, or RAD, which centers around a helicopter on Mars. Sound familiar? Shout out to Ingenuity. Go Ingenuity! Good luck and we look forward to you doing great things with NASA, for America, and for the world. Thank you, NASA. As you heard from my colleague Lisa earlier today, we have a really awesome competition experience in the live remote tournament system, which enabled 160 VEX IQ Challenge middle school teams to join us for subdivision finals, which will begin in just a few minutes. After we have subdivision champions, those teams will get ready to play in overall finals later tonight. Join us at 6.30 p.m. this evening to find out which of these teams will be able to call themselves champions of the world. I have just gotten word that we have our first award winners finalized, the Innovate Award. This award is presented to a team with the most effective and efficient design process, a top contender for the design award. This team's engineering notebook is a clear, complete, organized document of the design process. This team demonstrates effective management of time, talent, and materials. The students also understand and are able to explain how they worked together to develop their robot. The Innovate Award goes to...
Thank you, Stephanie. And congratulations to all of our award winners. We'll be giving out additional awards later today. But before we wrap up live remote tournament matches, let's take a look at our LRS highlight. Wow, such amazing work. Before we wrap up, Dan Mance has a quick special message for our teams. D -d 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 DJ Dan. DJ Dan. 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 <laughs> DJ Dan. Oh, hey, crazy cats. This is DJ Dan. We're here in the REC Foundation Studios celebrating the 2021 Live Remote Vex Robotics Championship. We're so glad to have you guys with us here today. We've been rocking all the hits. We've been watching teams score on Autonomous. We've some great competition, and we've got some hits to celebrate today. For you students out there, these are called 45s. This is We Are The Young, and we know you young students out there are making a difference. Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers, the waiting. You guys have been waiting this entire season to show what you got, and you guys have been rocking it. Run to you after you guys hit those great scores, run into your teammates and celebrate, and we love that energy in the REC Foundation Studios. Hazy Shade of Winters. This is the staff and the volunteers. It's kind of all hazy right now, but you guys have been putting on a great, great show. And finally, my favorite hit, don't you forget about me. When you guys are back at school next year, don't forget about all the fun you've had at the REC Foundation Vex Robotics World Championship. And with the fourth edition, Dan Dreams of Memes, this is DJ Dan Mance. So thank you everybody for all the great memes you guys have sent over the last couple days. So we have a best show ever, I think, and uh, let's get started. When you are early to the comp and the doors aren't open yet, and now we wait. It's great, it's so great to go to Vex Worlds every year when we we're in Louisville and see the lines waiting for those doors to open. That is the energy. DJ Dan. When you're done with the stress of preparing for state and finally inner peace. We're all in the same position, guys. It's been a great two weeks, but we're all ready for some R&R &R too. When you change the code from the right side to the left side and it works on the first try, hey, sometimes all you gotta do is recycle power. <laughs> when you decrease the degrees your robot is supposed to turn and then it turns more, that's happened to me. I remember when I was programming a robot and I did that and I couldn't figure out, and then I learned it's all about math. DJ. Us brainstorming our killer design at the beginning of the season. Also, us showing up on our first competition. Yeah, you know what, it's okay. That's why we have so many competitions. It's all the iterative design process. And I love the fact that we all think we got killer designs. And sometimes they're a pussycat, but you know what, by the time we get to Vex Worlds, they're all world champion robots in my mind. Dan. <laughs> the dog ate my homework. The robot shredded my homework, yeah. So, hey, why blame the dog when you can blame your killer robots? <laughs> we should probably set some goals for Worlds. Let's beat our personal best skills score, win an award at Worlds, get a meme featured by Dan Mance. So I hope you guys have been having as much fun with us as we have. Um, Dan's dreams of memes may make an appearance again in the future, but we know we've had some fun with this. Mentor. Good job, guys. You're working so hard today. Our team who spent the last hour making Vex memes. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know, but I used to be a coach too, and there's nothing harder when does a coach when uh, everybody gets a little bit distracted. But hey, our program's more about the robots. It's about teamwork and building relationships. So keep making those memes. Sorry, coaches. 
It's DJ Dan. When you did all the work on the robot, producer, director, actor, I hope you guys can see this. So, hey, I wanna give a huge shout out to our production crew here. Um, you guys don't see them behind the scenes, but they've been filming all this and they've been doing all this work. So thank you guys, you rock. Wicka, wicka, wicka. Da, 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 DJ Dan. Reading the game manual, spamming the Q&A as soon as it opens. So my favorite part of the season is the game unveil, without a doubt but probably the hardest part of the season is all the Q and A's. So, hey students, in another few hours today, you are gonna have your game unveil for Vex IQ. So before you start asking questions, the very first step should be reading your game manual. So, <laughs> me explaining the new game, the DoorDash driver. Is it more fun when you uh, are so excited about what we're doing and you wanna tell your aunts or uncles or siblings and they're just sitting there, uh-huh, uh-huh. So, love the enthusiasm. <laughs> Driving thinking our skills are going well. Leaderboards. <laughs> hey, you know what? In my opinion, it doesn't matter who's on top of the leaderboard. You guys all did a great job just being here. One, two, three. <laughs> Grant, we love you, man. This is amazing, though. Grant auditioning for the live action role of Count Van Count from Sesame Street. That is incredible. So I think we all appreciate everything Grant does for this competition. And finally, after four episodes, I think I finally understand what memes are. So, um, hope you all had a lot of fun. Hope you guys enjoyed Vex Robotics World Championship. Congratulations to all our winners. Um, hope you love the new game. We're so excited to show it to you. And we will see you all in 2021-22 season. So for the REC Foundation Studios, this is Dan Mance shutting it down. <laughs> Well, it's time for division finals. The first step towards being the next champion of the world starts now.